Okay, I'm going to show you how to replace the battery in this thing or the USB charger port if that breaks. Now, I have this already apart, so I do explanations on this one, okay? <coughs> Let's see how much time we have there. Um, first of all, on the top, you can take this rubber ring off that's just glued on with on a few spots. You can do the same on the bottom. Those. Then when you have that, there is four screws on top. You can take those out. Carefully remove this. The same you can do on the bottom. Uh, when you have that done, you can remove this whole thing here. Like this. Just pull that off gently. Here. This also moves down here. How do I do this? Like this. Um, there will be a bunch of screws in here. There will be tape over it, like this kind of stuff. Okay, so that all has to come off. Um, this black plastic piece has to come off. There is a bunch of screws in here. Um, it's holding the keyboard in here. If you see that you can see here, like this. Um, there is the camera here. Very difficult with uh, wires like this. They go through here, but the problem is they are inside with black goop in there. So you can't just remove them and you cannot unplug the wire from here because it's glued on. So they glued on the wire first to the camera and then glued the camera into this plastic piece. Mine is broken now so I take that off. Same for the keyboard. The keyboard will have this wire attached here and it goes through this hole to the inside, right? So this has to be also be unplugged. Now the easiest to unplug those is if you go through here. So this is not a speaker. It's a metal piece with a membrane-like thing. It's glued on here on this ring. And inside there then, from the main board, there is a bunch of wires connected to it. Two of them. This one and this one will have the flat band cable on it. And it comes through this hole here. But there is hot glue in there. This kind of stuff. So, um, hot no, not hot glue. In this case, it's more the black glue there. So this has to be removed first, pulled out without damaging those wires. Very difficult in order to get this off the keyboard and the camera. Right? If that is off, then you can pull this whole thing up and remove it. Then you will have those plastic protections. They are on here on the LEDs all the way around. Those have to come off because you have to take this LED PCB off on this side and one on this side to get to the battery compartment here. Okay, the battery compartment, there is also the charger and the aux in here. If you take this off down here, it's also glued. In there, you can disconnect the battery, the battery plug. That is hot glued in place. Very difficult. Now, you can open this this way. Like this. Then the charger and the aux and the battery wires are glued in here like nobody's business with hot glue. The only way I see to get this out is to heat it up here in this area and in this area with a hot, a hot uh, air gun to make this stuff soft. And then you can pull this out with wires attached to it. There is a bunch of wires on there. 
like this kind of wires go through the hole. A bunch of them go through the hole, so you would have to get the plug through here, and it's super tight. So all this goo has to come out, but you have to heat it up first. So I can show this on the battery. The battery, you cannot damage at all, so you have to be careful pulling this out. It's not glued in, but it has this foam around it. And then once you have it heated up, you can pull this out here through that hole. I don't know if I can do this now. The battery is always difficult. Do not damage those wires, do not damage the battery at all. This thing can explode. What means explode? It doesn't explode, it just catches on fire like shit. Okay, um, if you want to take it apart any further from this, you have to take all those LEDs off. I'm going to put them here. In my case, they broke off already a few from the cables. The cables go through this hole, also hot glued in there. Pain in the butt. Bunch of screws here. Then you can remove this cage. If you have the cage removed, you can remove the speakers. They are plugged in here. This is one, here's the other. They are plugged in into the main board. The main board has a bunch of connections to it. Um, here, this one, the microphone wire, very thin wire. There will be hot glue in all those four corners. This has to come off from here. Get the hot glue out and then you could, in theory, push this out here. The main board on the middle and then this will be empty except you have the Bluetooth antenna in here. On this side. The switch for the color switch there and the microphone down there and yeah that's how this thing is taken apart put it back together is a whole different story I don't think that works that easy yeah a difficult thing to replace parts